Only a few weeks ago, another Windows update was causing major problems for those that downloaded it. But Microsoft is back with the same antics, this time with update KB5035853 that began rolling out on March 12th. The update is rolling out and is automatically installed on millions of Windows 11 PCs due to the fact it's a security update and not a driver or feature update. The extensive delivery means that large numbers of people are potentially affected by updates that cause problems, and sadly, that already seems to be the case with KB5035853. The issues also appear to be wide-ranging from blue screen, or BSOD crashes, stuttering, and poor performance. This thread on Reddit had dozens of users reporting issues before it was locked. Some users reported that their systems used AMD processors, although there's certainly not enough evidence to point any fingers there just yet. Another user reported that their audio software was working the previous evening, but the morning after the update was installed, it was stuttering and performed poorly. Uninstalling the update has fixed the problem for many that found it had been installed, although some reported they were stuck in a dreaded blue screen loop. The news comes as Microsoft's Windows Update team has been plagued by issue-ridden updates, which caused issues with Windows Explorer, the taskbar, and other performance-related issues and crashes. Annoyingly, update KB5034765 caused error messages that appeared to be PC memory-related sending users on wild goose chases when troubleshooting their devices. If you suddenly experience similar problems to those described above, it's worth seeing if the update has been recently installed on your PC. To do this, open the Start menu and type Update, then click on Check for Updates. This will show you any updates that have been installed and are awaiting for a system restart to complete the installation. If the update KB5035853 isn't listed in the top list, click on Update History to see if it's previously been installed. If you want to uninstall it to investigate if it's causing issues with your system, head to the bottom of the Update History page and you'll see the option to uninstall updates. If the update has been installed, it will appear here. If your system isn't suffering from any issues, then it's worth leaving the update installed.